Oh man. More messed up. Uh, this is such a fast lineup from Quincy Crew. A lot of healing, sustain, tower damage from Lash. We talked about I it. Do you have two sustains? Sorry, go on. I, I would love to see some Lycan. On Quincy? Yeah. Yeah. I agree. I just think you we, we died, but you have two heroes that sustain. It's almost impossible to do. We saw that's how J Storm got into the major actually against Quincy Crew. So looks like Quincy Crew might be taking a page out of the uh the book that beat him. Quincy Huskar. I want to see it. Let's go. Huskar, I mean, it's versus Ember. Hey, you know, it, honestly, it's not the worst pick right now. It's good versus Mag and Ember, to be fair. First, though, it's Team Plus. You see Dazzle. You think, is it too late to get an axe? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and they get an Oracle. Oracle. <laughs> so they get a save of their own as well as some healing. I don't know if this can work to your benefit or not, but I notice a fun thing I like to do when I play Oracle, either against or with an ABBA, is you can have a lot of fun interacting with a shield with Purifying Flames. You can, like, force pop it early. Um, what is it? Uh, if he can't take healing damage, you can, like, keep forcing him down with Purifying Flames. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, I know what you're talking yeah, about. It's, you know, there's some cheeky stuff you can sync them together with. Oracle's one of those heroes that still a lot of fives and pubs do not know how to play. And that's one of the, like, you should. This hero is so damn good. Mm -hmm. So if you're out there, like, I want to support and gate MMR. No, no. But practice. can't play Oracle, you're not yeah, getting MMR. Exactly. you got to <laughs> yeah. practice. Get into that workshop and just learn his abilities. Just do, like, overthrow, you know? Ogre. Overthrow to uh, learn the abilities and fart around without having to lose your MMR. Yep. Ogre. Yep. Okay. Well, I like it. you got a good blend of supports. So they need one hero who benefits from all these spells. They need one big carry that they protect <laughs> plus Bloodlust. It could be Huskar. It could be. Yeah. Honestly, yeah, I know. think Huskar might blood get banned. Bloodlust and... Uh, Bloodlust, Grave, Shield, Heal, yeah. or Troll? I think it'll be either Lycan or Husker, honestly. I think... Lycan doesn't goes. benefit that much from uh, Bloodlust, but I would love to see Lycan... Just running around. Just run and run at people, and they don't have any tower defense on Team Plus right now. Yeah, and that's the biggest thing they need, because their towers are going to get shredded. Trying to think, what's a good hero form right now that provides all of that? Well, likely, uh, we still don't know if this is definitely going to be a Magnus Radiant three or four. There is a troll, but it's on the other side. Interesting. I guess they figure trolls one of the best. Like if we have to throw down, you know? yeah, <laughs> and it's going to be clearly four protect one. I got to have someone who's going to really have a say in the fight. Yeah, he is going to need farm, because Troll Warlord with just, like, one they, item does not feel ooh, that they strong. They can get Slark. Dusa. No, oh, they can I was going to go themselves. back to Grant's little Dusa call out. Deuce? Is it Dusa versus Troll good? She just pops Gaze. He can't do anything about that. But th if they pick Slark, then they have a good laner against Ember Spirit. And, uh, I mean, Slark with Bloodlust plus all this save can just go <sighs> insane. Like, I'll he does though, not care. As a Dazzle, I hate having to support a Slark because they're just all over the place and they're like ulting, and it's actually hard to grave them. Yeah, but he's going to be bloodlusted, so he will yeah, be bigger. Yeah, moving faster. <laughs> yeah, you'll see him easier. <laughs> yeah, you'll see him easier because he's bigger. He has a shield and he's gigantic. There he is, Dakota. We know that's the problem. You just can't see him with yeah. your boomer eyes. <laughs> <laughs> True that. It's like in my glasses. I can't see him. I can't see him. I'm with <laughs> when did you get glasses? Both of you. Like, when uh, did you get diagnosed with shitty eyes? I think it was like really three months ago. It was like ninth really. grade, ninth grade, Damn. and I started with the transition lenses. Oh, if you don't know yeah, what that yeah, is, yeah. that's when you know you step outside, they turn into sunglasses, and then you step back inside, and they change back. Except they don't change back fast. <laughs> so you just look like a, a D bag <laughs> in school. You just have sunglasses on. You look like yeah. a dumbass yeah. in the back of math yeah. class with his sunglasses <laughs> that are slowly morphing. <laughs> Like, yeah, I'll, I promise I won't come back and do harm to the school. Yeah. <laughs> and hey, there's a... <laughs> oh, they went with the axe. They did, they go with did the find axe. a way to squeeze it back into the lineup. So it is going to be a four Magnus, much to our pleasure, I think. I love dunks. I love dunks, too. No, you don't. You love Lich. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I actually do love Lich. Lich is one of the greatest years of all time. I have 125... Carry Lich, Lich, let's I go. Love Lich. Dude, what if they do? Carry Lich with the dance down. <laughs> Bloodlust healed. This is it. This is the moment. With the talent and everything. Dude, uh, that would be dope. It's, th uh, it's going to be a Slark. I think no. you're right. No. Huskar. I want Huskar. Not but I think Huskar versus not, Axe. Not, yeah, Axe that's and the Troll problem. is like a not good anymore. Get the Slark. We've seen it. Quincy Crew already did the middle Slark ones too, so we know they do do it. They go OD. All right. Ooh. 
So we'll be the Carrie Lushrag we talked about. Old Dirty. Interesting. And a four dazzle. So a dazzle that's going to have items. Too. Uh, how, like, how do you initiate? The axe is not going to have a game. You jump. Jenkins it's going to be a do. shield yeah. plus uh, astral plus a grave. Yeah, axe is good against, but there's going to be a ton of heal. A stun. Uh, yeah, it's quite annoying. Also, there's the follow up. Once axe jumps in, uh, like, there's literally zero burst damage. Not much. So is this. The la okay, so you called a ninety-five to five, and it yeah, was I'm wrong. Say I called a ninety-five to five, and it was wrong. So Are we helping Team Plus here? Remember, sure. the, remember go the Oreo picked Team five. Plus. It did the Oreo pick? That's team the five percent. The Oreo. The Oreo is the five percent. You know what? I actually do really think Quincy Crew. Once again, I you know I'm in, I'm willing to admit I'm wrong, but I think Quincy Crew outdrafted him pretty heftily here. Ninety-seven three. All they have is chip damage. Yeah, and that's and as you said, that's the problem. Look at the, how many times can they reset with all their heals, shields, astrals, bloodstone on the lash rag even? Like, yeah, quite a few times. So I think the pretty much what we're saying is Team Plus this laning phase needs to be spectacular, marvelous. Yeah, they need a way to like carve a path to somehow this troll being a god. A god yeah. He's just in there, like, tearing shit up. The Oracle's bailing him out with the ulti. You got Magnus providing the boxing gloves and setting up the show along with Axe. But that just seems like, when all the stars align perfectly, <laughs> you know? And it's like, dude. The heavens You're indoors shower. and the door's shut. You're not even looking up at the, the sky. The meteor shower. You know, it's it's not happening, old man. I will say, at least the axe is using the best set. He's using the axe he drags on the ground, not those punching ones. I love the one. But that's the, one of the oldest ones. Yeah, right? it is. It's really, really old. You know what one I like is the big single blade. Where he holds it with two hands. Oh, the yeah, witch no. Blade? Not the witch blade, though. What is it? You don't know what I'm talking about? I, yeah, I, know, I know what, what you're talking, talking about, about but it's a no from me. You don't <laughs> it's like a no that from one? me, dog. I like it. I like it. I, I would take this one because he, he pulls it on the chain. ground. Yeah, it's a big chain, chain axe, like yeah. a chain flail. It's like a flail. See this one? He's just. How many Blood different chaser. medieval weapons, Grant, do you think we've talked about in our qualifier run so far? A decent amount, which is good. We're helping people learn, which is important. Yeah, it's important to. To know about the Renaissance. Yeah, like honestly, learning that a bastard sword, all that means is that it's a left handed sword. Honestly, it's a cool thing to learn. I didn't know that. Yeah, thanks, Legends of Dragoon. That's not right. All right, let's get into it now. The Quincy Boys. Are, they're out at it again. Let's gentlemen. go, Jenkins. Here we go on Team Plus. It's the team that could stop Sue Mail. It's Godzi on the Oracle. Yum, son. On the Troll Sonic from across the lands on that Magnus. And it's Jenkins, Dota Alchemy, the king of everything on that axe, but it's Sammy Boy. Can he back it up and can he drop it off on top of Quincy Crew? We'll have to find out. Wonderful intro there, Grant. Thank you. I am now a Team Plus believer. I am too. They got this. I'm dying, apparently. I need to have some Yeah, what's monster. going on? Are you okay? Know, my, my throat just suddenly has, like, that really dry spot. You know what I mean? Sometimes, like... And you, it just... The liquid's not hitting it. Yeah, you know? it's like one tiny <laughs> patch of a, of oasis in your yeah. throat that's dry. And you're like, what is that? Stop it. Uh, but I think I'll survive. I mean, I can help you with that. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll bring you a monster. <laughs> and there's... Uh, <laughs> so Quincy Crew, I like it. They plant... They don't even do an uh, century. They actually put a full Observer Ward in that block camp up top. And... Yeah, if there's going to block, and this is a scary lane. It's a double stun lane, once again, Leshrac plus Ogre. Yeah. And he's going to block it, so Sumail blocks the enemy team's creep, so it's going to push into their tower. We'll see if Yamsun does the same thing. Oracle can't really do anything. Uh, if I was the Oracle in this, I'd focus on denying my creeps faster, using the Purifying Flames. Yeah, I'm denying hit. Well, honestly, it's that's fun. pretty good once for Once you're level two plus. with it, you can like free deny your range creep without the enemy even touching it. Yeah, meanwhile, on the bottom lane, Jenkins trying to creep skip. No two stout shields anymore. Dazzle, one of the better heroes, just keeps... Deny him, MSS. Yep. Keep using that poison touch, attacking him. Can't do much. Yep. Well. Did you notice that uh, one of the guys has DTS Dendy in his name? Yeah, Sonic. He's Sonic. a Russian player, yeah. He looks up to Dendy. Oh. I was wondering why he's muted for me. <laughs> <laughs> you probably have played with him. He is a from Europe. Was he actually? Yeah. <laughs> just just the voice, so though. Oh, okay. That's 
Just the voice. He didn't get. You'll watch him too. typing. If he types you where to go, you know that's a little bit nicer than just yelling. How how long did it take you guys to mute someone in game? If someone yells for no reason, that's a straight up mute. I mean, yeah. <laughs> immediately, no <laughs> second just chance. Yells for yeah. no reason. <laughs> <laughs> Muted. <Yeah. laughs> and that's not I how you win a game. It's you can not. yell if we're winning, like, yes, let's go, stun this guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah. Other than that, please don't. <laughs> please don't. <laughs> yeah, that's fair enough, though. Don't need any extra uh, random noise pollution. Yep. Jenkins actually If you're not contributing time. anything positive or trying to win, please, yeah. do, please don't do oh, it. Oh, okay. okay. I thought you were going to go, uh, okay. Man, this is actually going pretty well for bottom lane. Jenkins and Sonic are just harassing MSS. He hasn't really used the poison that successfully yet. Yeah, a bit awkward for him right here as they juggle with him and Yawar deals with the lane on his own. Double you know. damage scout out. Oh, yeah, bottom lane. Sonic will see it, and he'll take it. Jenkins. He does need to be a little careful. Sonic's coming in now, though. Hello. Oh, he might get a kill. He has security. He's dead. dead. Oh. One more. The poison. Nah, he has boots. Nice. Yeah, I'm going to unmute him right away. Yeah, he's, he's a good player. Dude, that was nice. He just he went and scouts the rune at two minutes. It's the perfect rune, and he just gets the first blood. Yeah, Sonic with the tip. You earned it. Okay, this guy. Spicy. I like it. That's a man who's been playing in NA for a while. He has been. You got to do it back. No sentry ward, by the way, for this top lane. So this block camp is helping Quincy crew quite a bit. This Leshrac 15 and 3. And SVG just gonna bonk him on the head. That's probably one of my favorite right click sounds too. Just the ogre just yeah, ogre. I hit you. Boom. Ogre's good. We mentioned troll before. Yeah. I also think CK's is pretty oh, nice. Sonic bottom, sorry. He Whoa. might die to the poison. He has a bottle. Oh. One more right click the shield. Help me. Yeah. But he's gone with those he's boots. He's okay with boots. Yeah. Now MSS needs to actually be careful. He could skip. If he wants oh. to suicide for MSS, he could. The do it. Are there. Skewer in. Dude, he's thinking. He's, yeah, I got, I got. Please do it. Does MSS know he's there? He's, I don't think he's so. He's pump faking it a bit. He's thinking he's Dude, going to Jenkins, Jenkins, Jenkins is alone. Jenkins! <laughs> what? what are you doing? <laughs> what? Oh, oh. <laughs> Jenkins, <laughs> baby. What are you a doing? Bit of miscommunication. <laughs> oh, that's painful. And I can assure you, Jane's like, dude! You should have been here and look at it. Actually, he thinks, too. He's like, Radiant has vision here, but it's just MSS being smart. Well, according to the cost, uh, Sonic probably yelled. Yeah, he probably just started yelling, and then Jenkins just mutes him immediately <laughs> in-game. Yeah. And hence the kill. Sonic was no f yet davai, and yeah. uh, <laughs> Jenkins did not understand. <laughs> so, lane's going pretty well in Quincy Crew again. How, how is Mill? We haven't checked. 24-9 versus 20-1. and one. It's going pretty Radiant damn well for old CCNC. Yeah. I just can't help but oh, keep my MSS eyes on bottom, bottom lane. Yeah, yeah. it's because the MSS and two support show that's going on over here. He's even <laughs> laughing about it now. He can't believe what's going Dude, wait, on. Wait, the turnaround. But oh, Yawar, no. he shows up. He's like, that's enough. Stop messing with my man. Gets him with the shield and starts to chase out Sonic a bit. Giving him the old rope-a-dope. I mean, this is, I mean, MSS is fine. Look at the Woo! levels. Look at the levels on rating. Yawar is already going to be level five and a half after this, while Jenkins is what? Level barely three and a half. You're a monster. <laughs> yeah. oh, it's making me miss all the action, unfortunately, as we see Sumail rotate. Oh, no, not rotate. I'm just so it's used to kill. seeing Sumail rotate from the mid lane with a lesh. Yep. And he gets it. Pretty good, though. They get both the... Uh, both runes top, both runes bottom. You know, the normal two for two, but Magnus does have a bottle, so a little more beneficial. And guess what? MSS and Jenkins are back, and so is Sonic, so we might just see the old 2v1 behind this tier one. Oh, it's hard to look away. From I'm enjoying this. The MSS shenanigans is, that are going on in the bottom lane right like now. Like, MSS is actually barely level two, but he doesn't care because Sonic's level two, Jenkins is only level three. Dude, but oh, they my got God, him. dude, they got him. MSS. Or do they? Yeah, oh. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I gotta find a way run to get great. Jenkins probably. run to the bottom lane. Yeah. Also, he used the flask and the bottle. And meanwhile, oh, Yavar just hit level six. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna Five be minutes before, yeah. yeah, before six minutes. Pretty Must be good. nice. Middle lane looks like they want to be something. Sammy Boy's oh. just jungling, though. Yeah. He's uh, crossing paths with SBG right now, who will rendezvous back with Quinn in the mid lane, who is the king of CS oh, in this one. Catapult. Mm -mm -mm. Last strike taking a lot of damage top, but a nice stun. Hits it on the troll, so he gets out. Okay. 
Might have a swing in through the mid lane. It looks like Sonic's here now. You, if you're top lane, you have to pressure because you know that the hero's uh, middle, so it's a two v one top. You can't let Sumail farm, and they do scare him back a little. Yeah, but he'll be fine at he least is. taking the CS under uh, the tower. It's rough. So Lesh is gonna have solo XP, solo farm. I'm not seeing plus looking to pull the trigger up there. Yeah, they really can. That's the problem because like when someone leads, you're like Lesh has no escape mechanism. We can just run at him, but when he's this close to the tower, you can't. So he's just gonna get solo. Finally, for the first time in a while, MSS doesn't have to deal with the 2v1 because <laughs> Jenkins is going to work in the jungle for now. And it's just going to be Sonic down here to do uh, a lot of the creep pulling shenanigans. But as I say that, look who it is. He's Yo. coming to aid things out with SVG here. They are going to try to make it an even score, but then Yawar is TPing in to help out his boys. And now it's a bit awkward. <laughs> Jenkins what is got an angle? What a clown show bottom. <laughs> this is actually just a circus. All right, put on some music <laughs> that go <laughs> down. We got it for you, boys. There we go. Get out of there, Jenkins. <laughs> that literally is this lane. It's just like two level twos at seven minutes in running at each other. <gasps> they can't. No one's going to die. <laughs> He's found his way out. It ain't Dota, baby. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> bottom lane is ours. Says both teams, apparently, since no one's going to die. Middle lane, I like it. Uh, Sammy Boy actually scans out the OD, stealing his stack, but he knows, <laughs> so he won't get ganked. And he just it's good out. if the scan doesn't connect in this yeah, situation. Yeah, you're like, okay, please don't. Nope, my stack's gone. And he's level <laughs> 8. Triple null with treads. He is going to do some damage. Yeah, we could see him and the crown one shot the territory bit. later. And the crown, the king. Yeah, if uh, this goes later and we have a Magnus Axe situation, oh, we don't have a lot Gwen, of levels. Come on. XP. There was a haste rune. You just missed it. Nighttime miss. Whew. And he's going top. He wants to get that kill. Oh, Yamsa might already die to just Sumail. One more right click. Is that enough? Oh, oh it is. Eating bot oh, gonna be there. Yeah, so they might just that. go for the tower up here now. Nice assault from Sumail. Quinn not even necessary. Could hang around to see if someone TPs back to lane, but uh, you know, he's an active core, probably doesn't have the patience for that, or does he? I just get a tower. And we do, and the, the whole reason, even though you're probably wondering, hey, why is the axe still pulling at seven minutes in? It's because if ABBA has one creep wave on this tower, he can pretty much take, like, look, the tower's at full. I wonder how much damage is actually going to get done to this. This is the first time they've had a creep wave at the tower. And they're going to do, like, what, a good 20, 30% to it. And that's the thing. D Jenkins probably wants to continue Jenkins cutting the creep wave. Jenkins brought two healing cells. He did. Oh, and he's coming. You are. Got help from the side. I see Oracle trying to flank in from one front and Troll here from the other. Yamsen. After that takedown by Sumail, makes his appearance to the bottom lane. Sumail's Jenkins eating a lot of damage. Sumail's here, and he is the big goat. He he's is. got all the damage. And now trouble. He does get this, the Fates Edict off, which will prevent a lot of that magic damage. But the right clicks still keep coming through. He's healed himself though. Oh, if someone else was no here, mana. and one more purifying flames, it could do it. But there's no one else. Uh oh! Now Sammy Boy's getting run at. Top lane, yeah. The Ember Spirit up in arms with uh, Quinn and SVG, but make some space. And now Ooh. this bottom tower is definitely going to go down. A full Vlad's on Yawar in his stash. He has two points in his E with. A siege unit coming, not this wave, but next wave. Sammy Boy needs to be more active. In both of these games, first 10 minutes, wasn't involved in a single game. Jenkins. Oh, my. He really doesn't like Jenkins. I'm pretty sure they didn't need that, but they don't care. MSS now. is like, do it for me. I guess they wanted to get there for the rune. Uh oh. Quinn's in a little bit of trouble. Yes, he is. Never Good mind. stun from SVG, but they want a remnant forward for more. Troll has half his life, has to be a little bit careful. Nice. They will get the snipe. That was a good play. Even with no points in the Searing Chains, they're still able to bring him down. No. Or this Oracle's like, I just want level 6. Defend this tower. Well, now the tower's Just hit him with a Fates down. Edict. Tell him to stop attacking it. They might get a tier 2 oh, off bottom, himself. honestly, because they have the Siege unit coming now. They have to bring so much down to stop a freaking uh, young man. The disarm, Dakota. Yeah, I know you love it. Disarm deny. Disarm deny. He did a little too early, but I, you don't want to risk it. Yeah, risk it but for the best. That is a lot. <sighs> All right, uh, lads coming for the Yawar Abad. They're yeah. definitely taking this tier two. He's I'm big. pretty sure. Ogre. And he has bloodlust. Yeah. Oh, we're approaching. They're drawing out to get Jenkins here potentially. Oh, he just slipped behind the tree, and I don't think they saw him. Damn, Jenkins, the human Ooh. ward. One moment later, and he'd be dead. 
They do spot the Oracle instead, but he does manage to slide out. Now they might have some numbers here. They do. Oh, but Jenkins just gets hit right away with a big stun and a wealth of damage. Nothing he could do about it. Sammy Boy will try to slide out from the bottom. Oh, oh, SVG waiting where the Revenant is, but uh, they make it inside. Yeah, that might go, in his base, they might by the go way. for Tier 3. What? You are? You are literally in oh their face. Oh, my God. Yeah. Why I is he way up there? I love the Oracle line, too. That, <laughs> yeah, the guy's the dead in his own base. <laughs> I mean, this is ABBA, and I, that's why I, was, we're, I think we're all surprised it wasn't banned out. Right? It's been banned in almost every game, especially Quincy. You are, will just play it every game. Yeah, this game is going to turn into a quick reminder that is on the dunk. why been banned. Let's go. Jenkins does manage to get Sumail down get for the four times kill streak and SVG. Feeling a little bit better now. It will be. The thing is, the CC and C out OD has been free farming. Current net worth is 6.3k, highest in the game. Yeah. Once this OD actually just ults the team, I think you wait for level 12, and that's probably when the Radiance can like group up as five and just take base. Where's the House of Avernus? There's no way that's part of the Nothal realm, right? The House? The House of Avernus has to be a separate thing. I think so. Okay. I think it's below the Nothal realm. Is it just his house, or is it an actual group of people? Wait, what's a Nothal realm? I don't know. <laughs> Something we always say in lore. No, it's it's the... Isn't that... It's the god, where the gods live, right? In Dota or something? Yeah. yeah no, it's an actual real thing in Dota. I just ask Slacks. So you just can't it. comprehend it with yeah. your feeble mind, unfortunately. Yeah, the Nazo realm is what you think it is. So for me, it could be different than what it is for you. Yeah. It's like the one Narnia. room in Harry Potter, Narnia. Yeah. yeah, it's like Narnia. Any sort of magic, yeah. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it does? Cool. <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right. I debate one. <laughs> And yep, they're just they're grouping up already. CCNC's not here, but they don't really need him yet. All right, we'll see what kind of approach Team Plus can make. Oh, as nice! As they see room. the threat on their tower, Sumail. Mac, low. big oh! RP. Sonic gets in there and tries to set things up for the rest of his team, and they're successful in getting the takedown of Sumail. SVG will also fall, but Yawar begins to set his sights onto Jenkins a bit, changes course. Sammy Boy's there, flies with side, comes back out. Good false promise. No will bail yeah. him out for now. No God one from Z. Team Plus goes down yet. Yet, because God Z has something to say about that. He does drop under the tower, and the tower will still be taken. They pop the shrine. Or not. Will chase. Plus, want to get back into it. Nice defense of the tower. Dude, Sonic, brown boots bottle with a gigantic. how this guy get managed? He just walks in. Hey there. <laughs> Wait, is he playing from Russia right now? I I'm not sure. I heard. Because there was a thing where he played with three Russian players that didn't live here and he wasn't allowed to play in NA last year, but it was a rumor that he was playing from New York, so I, I'm not actually sure. Wait, if we're he's in the game, we can check ping, can't we? Isn't there a console command? Because we're in the game. I'm checking. For now, he's playing the from the fire. Nothal realm. He is. They're able to surround and get the takedown of little Sammy boy, though. Quincy, they're right back into action across the river and back at the Tier 2. Trying yeah. not to let up any momentum from that previous mistake. They the consider. thing is, Quincy's crew does not have a single big ulti cooldown. I mean, they're really not relying on the Sanity's Eclipse to deal damage. No. They can fight all the time. They have the sustain, armor, and extra damage from Vlad, plus Medallion on top of it. Silence that barrack. Got it. Dude, what if you what silence yeah, the yeah, barracks? Yeah, creeps didn't say. spawn. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That the would be pretty insane. Imagine these builds where they backdoor silence yeah. so they don't spawn they in the lane. Dude, that would be insane. Woo! But oh! oh, how you doing? A dazzling death it was, Yamson. Though he's ulted up, and now he's gonna die. Goodbye, troll warlord. <laughs> From the Nothal realm to the Nothal death. <laughs> Double kill for Quinn. Look for plus. Can they get any snipes on the way out? No, it's a fake back. They might get sniped. Quincy. Going in, can they put the nail in the coffin as they take down Jenkins, the triple? Where's the give him the rampage? Wait up. I'm actually, I think they're going to. They're not going to dive? Well, they don't deserve it. Get him the rampage. I feel like you earn that, you know, by showing you go out of your way. Oh! 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 Oh my God, oh! The Sammy boy with empower. Wait, uh, how did God Z get both of them? <laughs> <laughs> Fortune's <laughs> end. <laughs> that's crazy, dude. That was 
a huge ulti though. It did so much damage. The empowered Ember actually does oh a lot of damage. God, that was so sick. And he's going to get another kill on MSS. Holy smokes. That was 2,000 gold right. for the Ember. I said I'm going to unmute Sonic, but didn't. Now I'm really going to unmute him. <laughs> Dude, what a play. The five-man RP. <laughs> that is... Both times... Wait, did he hit, a, he hit a blink for that one, right? Yeah, yeah. for that okay. one he did. That was if the blink. Said, oh, if he did both with just... Just walking bottle. in. That might be a mistake from the enemy team at that point. <laughs> like, I just think it's a creep or something. Yeah. God, he dies so quick. It must be a creep. Insane. But man, yeah, hey, they defend. And they do get Ember. He does have a full drum now. He's going to have a javelin as well if he wants to pick it up. So he will do... With that in power, he will do damage. That's the one good thing about also having a mag. It's like having a free item on some of these heroes who don't, like, do damage without items. I think if it doesn't work out, we could also uh, join a band. We had a perfect three-part harmony there, it sounded like. Yeah, I'm kind of like a tenor. Dakota, you're like yeah. an alto, and Lacoste, you yeah. can bass. <laughs> He's a soprano. Yeah. <laughs> I've never seen that show. Me Why, neither. really? Yeah. I, oh. I expected more from you, Grant. I've never watched it. I love Richard like and Mortimer. You don't <laughs> watch good. my show, therefore, I think lower of you. Well, what's The Sopranos about? It's about a mob boss named Tony Soprano, right? Yes. And but like, we're done. And we're done. There, that, there, there it is. is. That's, That's the, the show. You don't have to watch Spoiler it. Spoiler at home, everyone. Sorry about <laughs> See that See you next one. week for Breaking Bad. <laughs> <laughs> He does. He has that drum javelin. Honestly, this Ember Spirit is kind of scary with that in power up now. I mean, they're still very, very far ahead on Quincy Crew, but one oh, more yeah. Magnus ult. You honestly, th this guy, he makes it happen time and time again. Five seconds till it's up. The plays were just hype, even if it totally goes south from here. Brought and joy into my heart, and I'm sure plenty others. Let's see what they could do. I like the cheekiness. The Let's smoke go. behind play. Team Plus, get in there. Let's see what happens. Oh my god, Sammy boy. Find that double damage top rune. Doesn't look like he can. If he actually had that, then we're talking. Let's go. Quinn. Oh, they have the ward. Nice. The Radiant Sentry Scouts, and they know they have a ward now because of that. Yeah, they might have to just hit back indoors on this one. Not. Well, they're losing their base while they're doing this. Skewer and Sumail to the base. Oh, Yules. Oh, that's not good. He got found. They baited good. Sonic this time. Okay, false promise. He's just going to go for the RP. Yep. And he gets Skewer. the blink because of it. Okay, troll in there. Takes it away from the troll, but they're going to try to make the most of it while they can. How many slights? Oh. How much damage? Not enough. The sustained power is there. They drop the hammer. And, uh, well, there troll out now. Nearly 30 seconds. I think that might be it. Yep, they even find Samuel, boy. Is he going to make it? He's run little fire Silence. spirits. Uh, yep, and the counter. The right-click ab, and there's the GG called. Some high plays from our boy Sonic on this mag, but... Let's be honest, this is what we expect from Quincy Crew. They they did get knocked down to the minor qualifiers. They are this team of you have a freaking TI winner. You have MSS. Freaking TI winner. This MSS guy's been called the best up and coming player freaking for five Chad years. War over here. Yeah, you know, something's wrong. When you're always an up and coming player, <laughs> that is true. And then you have SVG. This man quit Dota and he's like, God, NA's bad. He I'm is coming like back. God. Yeah. yeah. And he's like, I will carry a team. And now, guess what? They are Two games away today from going to the Grand Finals. Not qualifying, but the Grand Finals. Yep. Yep. And, yeah. Uh, Team Plus, you you could see. I liked what they did bottom lane, uh, abusing MSS, trying to farm behind the tower, not letting the ABBA push. But I just feel like their draft, they were already so far behind. Right when they stopped cutting creep waves, the ABBA just took their tower. And you can't just always commit a hero down there when you're losing. I'm not sure that was that great of an idea. You don't you think so? have ABBA, all the solo XP. Dazzle just bought it home for himself. And uh, you have ABBA who has all his spells maxed out, suddenly pushing your tier 2, tier 3s. But do you think you could fight him straight up in the lane? Dazzle plus ABBA? Don't no. you just get heal bombed and lose? So I think you, like, had to. I don't know. I just thought it was a nice, cool thing. And then top, that was just... It was rough. You're playing against a double stun yeah. lane, and you have zero stuns. That's never going to be a fun lane. And then OD versus Ember... That you you lost that lane just before you were even yeah, playing like it. Maybe you try lane it and put the Oracle down there, but then you have Sumail versus the troll. Double stun versus troll and stuff. Yeah, it's no. I, I feel this one yeah. was pretty determined for the and they had two things to sustain. We've said if uh, I've said at least if there's two things to sustain, I'm picking that team. Abba, Dazzle, boom. All right. What about the cookie? The five percent.
The 5%. Well, we didn't see. We almost saw it. Sonic was one of the 5%, but Definitely. he needed his team to be the other ones, and they were not. Sorry, yeah. Oreo. Sonic, those were some hype RPs, though. Oh, yeah, I hope, it was. Uh, I hope uh, they do justice in the replay. And here, but, one yeah. sec before, because if you didn't know, we. Yes, good call. I'm going to go check the other series right now, because we will have to wait for that series more than likely, because we will be casting the winner's bracket finals, but that means we have to wait for this series. That's right. And, and then it's, there might be a break after that, so we have to see what's going on. This is game number two. It is, and it's very early in, but Demon Slayer is one game number one. They beat Joe Lottle, so Demon Slayer's mm. up 1-0 over Joe Lottle. Okay, so we are going to be taking an expected break here and then you know, just kind of see exactly what the plan is going to be. The official cast is going down, I imagine, on Beyond the Summit 2? No, that is actually South America. BTS, it is BTS 3. 3. All right, so lots of Dota still <gasps> going on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Pain Gaming lost 2-1 to No Ping. No Ping Esports brought it back after Game 1. So is Pain out? No, they're in lower bracket They're in now. lower bracket, but holy... So Pain Gaming, I think, was the definitely suspected second slot Yo, after sure. Anne Vergesa, and now they just lost to the King RD stack, who has like three, four new players on it. I think three, they have Theron, so shout out to them. I thought they were done after that game one. Dang. Wow. Oh, that's that's huge. Oh, we'll see if Pain can bounce it back or if they're going to tilt all the way down and out of this first major minor qualifier run. So South American... Yep. Dota action happening on Beyond the Summit 2. Who's commentating it, Grant, does it say? Yes, it does. Pythian Lagume and Ryan Ree, an NADCL player, NA up-and-coming guy, so, you know. Send him some love, knowledge. send some support, support the Tier 2, Tier 3 scene, guys. Get out there. On Beyond the Summit 3 is the other NA Dota action. And uh, like you said, that is the Jolotl versus... Demon Slayers. Demon Slayers. With Demon Slayers up one game to zero currently. And winner of that does play Quincy Crew. So, you know, you guys can do your own research at home and see how do you beat Quincy Crew. Exactly. All right, we're going to cut to a break. When we come back, we may be backseating that game. We may be taking a break. We may be trying to fill time. I have to find out exactly what we're going to be doing. But don't go too far. More DPC qualifier action to come your way.